What's good, YouTube? How's everyone doing? Today is, uh, I don't know, 22nd? Doesn't matter. But there's 100 days left today till the end of the year. So make that your motivation to get shit done. All right, I'm done with work. I worked 10 hours today. Made 200 bucks off of extra charges. Customer needed a bunch of things built. So me and my partner built it for her. And then 90 bucks in tips today. So today I made $540, pretty cool, can't complain. Yesterday I did not have work, but I did have a side job lined up, uh, which involved me hanging a ring doorbell camera, an address sign, two wall lamps, or wall scones, which I've never heard of before, but now I know what they are. They are lamps that essentially attach to the wall and then plug in, so lamps attached to the wall. They don't have to plug in, these ones plugged in, thankfully. Um, it would have been cool if I had to run wires through the wall, but I've never done that before. Um, and I had to take apart a bit. So yesterday, I charged the customer $400. I uh, picked up my buddy, we drove over there. Um, I paid him 100 bucks and paid myself 300 And we got a $40 tip, which... I believe, yeah, I gave him the 40 bucks. So he made 140, I made 300. Uh, and I didn't have work that day, my formal job. So it was really nice to have something like that lined up. Um, today I did, and that was a handyman, handyman work, which I am pushing handyman work. I just bought business cards, gave them to a bunch of people I work with so they can hand them out on jobs they do, as well as I gave them to both my customers today. So the way I look at it is every customer is potentially 10. You know, if you do a good job for them, they're gonna recommend you if their neighbor is like, oh, I just bought this thing, I need it hung up. Oh, I got a guy. And then boom, now that one customer turns into 10. Um, so I bought 5,000 business cards, which um, if I hand out every single one, it's potentially 50,000 customers. That's the way I'm looking at it. Uh, which, if I have 50,000 potential word of mouth customers, probably I'm good, you know? Uh, there will be jobs coming in consistently. And, you know, if I can't do it that day, I push it off till later in the week. And yeah, I'd be, I'd be making good money doing handyman work. If I could do three a day, that'd be ideal. Because I made 300 bucks off of the first one, and only had one yesterday. And let's say I had two more where I could average 300 bucks on those. That's $900, and uh, the first job took me two hours, so I averaged 150 an hour, and yeah, it's good money. Um, so yeah, I enjoyed doing that. I, even though I didn't have work, I still made money. Today I made good money, so I'm at $840 in two days. Um, yeah, can't complain about that, it's pretty good. So, these last 100 days, I am going to grind my butt off because I want to make as much money as possible. I want to make myself way better than I am today. In 100 days, I want to be a better version of myself right now. And if you could keep doing that and every day improve by like a fraction of, per of a percent, by the end of the year, you've essentially became twice as good of a person like twice a better of a person uh you could be stronger smarter making more money um driving nicer cars wearing nicer clothes whatever it is you want to do just work on learning something every day and improving every day in order to become a better version of yourself because it adds up you know you become one percent better every day it's one percent today but tomorrow compared to today it's like one point one percent you know and then a week from now you're kind of getting two percent better so it's compounding betterness like compounding interest compounding betterness eventually you become astronomically better of who you were um so yeah also anyone who doesn't know about compounding look up uh compound interest calculator and you will see uh, a dot gov website it's like the first thing that pops up on google and it's pretty cool, it's a plug and play calculator where you take your initial investment, let's say today you put $10,000 in and you could afford to put a uh, thousand bucks in every month. 
um, which I think most people can afford if they budget correctly and don't blow all their money on driving really nice cars when they don't have to and eating out all the time. So easily, anyone working right now can save a thousand bucks a month. And then if you could earn an average interest of 5% a year, which right now like CDs are paying 5%, um, stocks pay five. Well, stocks don't always pay five percent, but good blue chip stocks do, on average, go up by five percent a year. Um, so yeah, and if you do that by five years uh, or forty years, let's say. So right now I'm 28. So by the time I'm 68, this account would mature. I would be earning about a hundred grand in interest a year. So it's interest. And my account, I would have put in, let's say, $2 million in that 40 years, and my account would actually be worth $4 million. So pretty much anyone right now watching this video, you can be a millionaire in 40 years, which I know is a long time. But in 40 years, when I'm 68, it's going to be very nice to have... I'm going to have way more than $4 million, but it will be very nice to have four million you know as a retirement which in 40 years inflation and whatnot who knows what four million would even be worth you know maybe maybe grocery shopping would be four million dollars but regardless you can make a lot of money by compounding interest and as you get older you obviously earn more money so you can put more and more money in and get to your goal quicker um now this is something i wish i did when i was 18 because then by the time I'm 58, you know, at 40 years is really when things start going crazy and blowing up. So by the time I'm 58, I would have a lot of money just accumulated in this account, which is obviously better than 68. So just a little, little math for y'all. So that's really it. Um, 100 days left in the year. What are you going to do to become a better version of yourself? I'm working on myself. Let me know down below. What are you going to do to become the best version of yourself? Peace.